just thought I'd do a quick video on starter motor change on a 3HX turbo diesel or any other actually diesel engine. Um, basically it's held in with three Allen bolts which you can get to on the clutch, well gearbox side of the engine and they go through what is the starter down there, there and there. First thing I'd recommend you do is disconnect the battery on the positive terminals just because in a minute you have to disconnect the leads and you'll end up rounding it and shorting it. So if you disconnect the battery, then you've got two leads on the start you've got to take off. There's the main there's a bigger cable here that, that goes back to the battery, that's your main positive feed to the starter. And you've got the little wire here which is your feed from the ignition to put it in and to turn the starter on. So you want to do the both of those wires, making sure you've disconnected the battery first. And then um, remove the three allen bolts which I'll show you on the field car just so you can see where they are. Okay, a bit muddy here. As you can see Chris is uh, just doing something else. Um, that's the starter in position, a bit of a muddy one, but there are those wires I'm talking about. Got the one from the uh, ignition there, and that's your main battery feed there. I think it's a 13mm and an 8mm nut. Um, then the allen keys go right through the block there. It always crap out the way. One down there, one up there, and there's one just in by, in by the clutch lever thing, that one's a bit of a bugger to get to, sometimes you've got to remove the clutch, otherwise you can't get in square and you'll end up rounding the bolt off, as um, we found out back along. So basically, yeah, that's all there was to it.